How is it going out there, everybody? This is Speedboy14 uh, for the finale of my playthrough of the 100cc tracks and Mario Kart 8 Deluxe for the Nintendo Switch. I've really enjoyed this playthrough a lot. It's been a lot of fun to do. So if you guys give me a favor and drop a like on this video, I'd really appreciate that. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button and click on the bell right beside it. Be notified every time I make new videos. Exciting feature of the channel, you can request your favorite track, cup, character, or cards in the game in the comments below. Thanks for voting for the character for me to use for the final cup. I'm going to be using Bowser. Let's use the jet bike. Let's just use standard wheels and let's use Super Glider with a Bowser logo on it. We have done all of these cups except for the Bell Cup. So let me know down in the comments below what was your favorite moment of this playthrough. I would love to know. Because I've really enjoyed it. Mm -hmm. Three D S Neo Bowser City. Three D S Neo Bowser City is the name of this first track, and Bowser is a fitting character to play on this track. Skadoosh! Now we're doing the final cup of this playthrough. The Bell Cup. And these tracks are really awesome tracks. Pretty much expected to have awesome tracks in this cup because it is the Bell Cup. And thanks for voting throughout the playthrough about characters you wanted me to use for each cup. Or for the cups you did vote for me to play as characters for. What? You're having to do all these items at me? What the heck? We're doing pretty good so far on this race. This is a pretty cool track. Because I remember this track was also in Mario Kart 7. And I'm glad it came to Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Since Bowser is the final boss in Mario games anyway, it makes sense for me to play as Bowser for the final cup. Here we go to GBA Ribbon Road. This one's another pretty interesting track.
and really reminds me of the Celebration Avenue from Pac-Man Party. It's a pretty cool track. This is a pretty cool track. You get this, it's like a toy based track. They're very similar to what Celebration Avenue from Pac Man Party is, since Celebration Avenue from Pac Man Party was like a toy based world. And that's what this track reminds me of. What the heck? Those MLG Pro strats for the win of this track. Here we go. We have two more tracks left of this playthrough. And I'm looking forward to these two tracks that we're about to do. Here we go to Super Bell Subway. Super Bell Subway. This one's really awesome. Excuse me. This looks awesome. This looks like an awesome subway station. I've never really been to subway stations personally, but this one looks awesome. This track it looks this tra track looks awesome. You just have to watch out for the subways on this track. Mm 
it's pretty cool that you have different ramps you can take if you want to take those ramps. And they also have um, And there we go. It's cool they have different ramps you can take on this track. I just think it's cool. This is a really cool track. The last track is even more awesome than the other three. This one is another Captain Falcon track, which is big blue. It has sections instead of laps. That's the cool part about this track. It's another F-Zero based track. Here we go, the final track of the game and the playthrough. Here we go. That's not a good start. But I do have to warn you that this track is the hardest track in the game. This track is definitely the most difficult track in the game. Because this track is very difficult if you don't know what you're doing. I mean, once you get the hang of the layout of the track, it becomes easier, but it's still the hardest track in the game. Like, if you think Rainbow Road was hard, this track is harder. It's like twice as hard. Because there's lots of sharp turns on this track. I mean, it's not that hard once you get the hang of it, but... Just like any track, it's not that hard once you get the hang of it. What? But if you're playing on, it's not that hard on 50cc, but if you're playing on 100cc like I am, or, or harder, this track would be a challenge. But we done pretty good on this track for 100cc. Okay, this is the easiest part of the track when you're this close to the finish line. Because now we have completed 100cc in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe for the Switch. We're the champion of this game. Enjoy these results. We got first place on every track in this playthrough, except for Rainbow Road in the Special Cup. And there we go. You have collected 360 coins. A new vehicle customization option has been unlocked. Here we go to the credits. All right, credits time. Time for me to give my opinions and thoughts overall on this game. This game is just a really fantastic game. I really enjoy it so much. I've really had a fun time playing the 100cc in this game. 
It was such a fun playthrough to do, the 100cc was. Like, it was so much fun. And I've just had a lot of fun with this playthrough. This game is a great game. Excuse me. One of the best Switch games out there. It should be one of the first games you should buy for your Switch. And plus, this game is easy to learn, too. Like, it's not that complicated by any means. It's a relatively easy game. Like, most of the tracks are pretty easy in this game. And it's a good game for beginners to play. Like, it's a good Switch game for beginners to play. Because this is a game anyone can get into with just a little bit of know-how to do. Um, like, this game is just really awesome. I really love it. The graphics are just so pretty and gorgeous in this game. Making the environments of each track just stand out. It just looks awesome. And that's what I love about this game. That's how awesome the graphics are. And I, I love that this game even has the booster course pass. Uh, and I love that they're able to expand on a game that's already such a good game. And I love that almost all the characters that you ha originally had to unlock on the Wii U version of Mario Kart 8, that on the on this version, which is the Switch version, you can you can play as the characters right away. You, that there's no specific characters you have to unlock, except for maybe some DLC characters. But other than that, you already have all the characters that you originally had to unlock on the Wii U version. But on this version. You already, you already have those characters, and that's good. And this is one of the best games on the Switch. I would definitely recommend you check it out. It was one of the first games to come out on the Switch, which is really awesome. And I really love this game. Like, it's really awesome. I would love to know in the comments below, what was your favorite moment of this playthrough? Was it due to a track you really like? Or was it due to the conversation I was talking about? Or was it, or, or what was it due to? I'd love to know what your favorite moment of this playthrough was in the comments below. I had a blast with this playthrough. I know it was a short one, but still, but I still had a lot of fun with it. And don't worry, there's going to be many, many, many more playthroughs to come. Be excited, because I'm going to be doing lots more playthroughs coming up. Like, that's going to be really awesome. I'm super excited about some of those. The graphics just stand out so good in this game. It's just a really good game for the Switch. Like, it's a really fun racing game. I just love this game so much. I love how different environments take advantage of the game. I love how there's a, I love how Link is one of the characters you can play as, and I love that there's characters from other Nintendo franchises you can play as. For the Final Four Cups, here's what I love about them, that they have, um... That they have tracks based off other Nintendo franchises, which is awesome. And I really enjoyed this playthrough a lot. All right, guys, that's it. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed, don't forget to drop a like. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button and click on the bell. Be notified every time I make new videos. Have a wonderful day. Peace, Republic of Speed Boy.